I started drawing comics when I was very little, and my um, parents encouraged me. And so I've just been drawing comics ever since then. I really wanted to emphasize the fact that it's drawings, you know, so much of animation is about hiding the fact that each frame is a drawing. It's like masking it so you don't notice that they're different. It really excites me when you can see that each frame is an individual drawing. You know, when you're seeing uh, an old Chuck Jones cartoon and they have to paint each frame the same, like, he had, like the people have the, the cell, and they have to paint each one up to the same color guide. Sometimes they'll screw up and you'll be able to see like an off guide moment or you can see the breaststroke for a moment. And so with Unclothed Man, you know, every single frame is like that. Every single frame is off model. Every single frame has a, a, a different way of drawing this person's arm. One of the important things when uh, doing the Unclothed Man is that um, they're short, they're very short. They're, they're uh, you know, minute and a half, minute, 45 second pieces. One of the pitfalls I felt like I had to avoid was uh, making it too much like a music video. And that was even more difficult because I felt very strongly that uh, each piece needed um, a constant music going throughout the piece to, uh, to tie it together. And so, you know, of course the keys were to really suit the music to the images and not allow it to be vice versa. I mean, as a musician myself, I don't think that there is any uh, art form on earth that really just speaks to the human soul more than music. To tie that to images um, is really a powerful effect. It's more like a feel, you know, you get a feel for a person when you meet them. And very much in the same way, you can get a feeling from a person by their drawing. Do they have like really bold lines? Are they like, are they very fluid? For example, my drawings tend to be kind of on the fussy side. They're, they're very fluid and they're very, very feminine. Dashes, on the other hand, are extremely masculine. They have all this energy. And sometimes they're not so concerned with getting everything right, but just the idea of the drawing. And it's, it's very true that that is so reflective of his worldview. And then my drawings are very reflective of my view. I'm more introverted, I'm more detail-oriented. The associations he makes between different things are very different from the way I see them. I get self-conscious about that kind of thing, but for him, it just, everything is so natural. It would be great if I could continue to make these animations and take on, you know, different projects. Like right now, I'm really just starting in this, and I want to, like, I want to continue and, and see where it takes me.